the act of getting dressed each morning has a, a significant impact each and every day. And it's not necessarily like putting on that interview suit, although that's important and that makes a difference. I'm always very jealous of someone who has a look. And maybe it's a, just because it's such a subjective experience, but I don't think I have a look. And I don't mean that as like I reinvent myself every day. I think the way I deal with having a look or trying to obtain a look is I know the pieces that I feel comfortable in. And it's always important to, you know, for your self-esteem or just to keep things exciting to kind of go for like more editorial pieces and uh, push the limits in, in some ways. But my relationship with style has been an evolution, as I think it is with many different people. It evolves to your experience, your environment. Living in New York, you're surrounded. It's, it's hard not to change the way that you interpret your own style. I think my first specific memory, it probably has to do with movies, watching movies growing up. Humphrey Bogart, James Cagney, and Peter Lorre. And it was on the more formal side, on the more, uh, you know, lots of black tie. And it was so foreign growing up in Southern California. You didn't see people wearing ties, especially in the 80s, but it was really uh, eye-opening.